Went to the casino for the first time. I got a little introduction to everything that was available. I tried out horse racing, lost, did a little race. And then I got into a little bit of a issue when I was trying to get to the finish line, but I eventually made it. Then I found my first mascot, had to take some guys out. And then I finished the day with a little bit of parachuting. And I'm back with dubs. Welcome to Click Fireball Media, home of hack slash PC and console games. Today is going to be a little bit longer of an episode than normal. I got a whole bunch planned for today, especially one big mission you're going to be seeing later in the episode. There are timestamps in the description of the video in case you want to go ahead and use them. And if you haven't done it yet, then I would appreciate that like, subscribe, and even slapping that notification bell. Now that I've said that, I'm going on the map and I'm marking my first destination for cargo. Along the way, I ran into this situation. I honestly don't know what's happening here, but things are going down. And I need to get away. We're just about there at the Grand Bank Steel Foundry. Just need to pull in. They're still fighting over there. And scattering. I don't know what went on. Didn't really seem like there were any players there. So it was a computer generated scenario. Anyways, I finally got here. I need to hack the security panel. This place looks hella familiar. It's almost like I've been here before. I'm trying to find the security panel. Looking around. This does seem familiar. Yeah, exactly. So that's where I'm supposed to be. Let's see if I can actually hack it. Well, we're starting. Well, damn. Okay, let me try that again. That was terrible. All right, we're going. Make it some turns. I'm doing all right. What the hell was that? All right, let me try it one more time. I think I'm going to get it this time. Or at least I hope. I haven't done it the first two times. So my confidence level, okay, is decreasing even more now. Let me try it again. But this time with more gusto. Aw, oh, damn, what? Well, I got took out. Some guy came up from behind me and pistol whipped me to death. Now I'm back here for revenge. I'm getting close to this guy. I know he's right by the security panel. I'm taking aim. Once I spot him, I'm going to start shooting. There he is. Right in the head. Is he going down? Well, I got him a couple times. Now he's down. That's what he gets for just blindsiding me like that. You know what? I'm not going to mess with the security panel right now. He's going to get me again if I stand here and try to mess with this thing even though I'm trying to actually activate it. Let me get away. And actually see where this guy is. I see a little circle moving towards me. I'm assuming it's him. Let me hide here. Or maybe is he coming from that direction? I think he is. Alright, I'm stepping out to confront the man. He doesn't really seem like he wants to fight, so... Let's see what the guy does here. And he's running right past me. Seems like we're good now. He took me out once, I took him out once. It's fair. And it seems like he is trying to activate the security panel. Or maybe I should try. Well, it seems like he's doing it. Yeah, I can't even activate it. So I'm just going to be waiting here until he gets done, I guess. 
Is that what's going to be happening? And that's exactly what happened. This man just disappeared behind the door? Why can't I go through? Can I activate the security panel? They're firing in there. I'm trying to help the man out. All right, I'm in. And he seemed to have gotten taken out. I'm firing. And can I take this guy out? He's elusive. I got him. And then how about this guy? Right in the dome. Oh, damn. Well, I got sprayed to death. I'm back. Reincarnated. And I need to get back into the place. There is Pupita. What the hell was that? Man just appeared right behind me. I didn't even see him run past me. Well, I'm in. And I'm going to be fired pretty soon. I'm getting shot at, but okay. The other guy got took out. Now this guy got, just got. And there's another guy hiding behind the pillar. He needs to die and he got took out. Someone is calling me a bastard. I think it's that guy. Well, he's getting shot at by Pupita right there. Me and him, we're gonna be killing everything here. Well, mostly everything. Until we need to pick up our packages and deliver them. Now, I think I had somebody in my sights. I'm still looking. I don't see nobody, I'm firing aimlessly now I need to get closer I'm looking around I'm seeing gunfire let me zone in on one of these guys but before I do that I need to pick up this package and now I can't just see where these guys are take them out I don't know where Pupita went but We came in here together until he gets what he gets, then, or I take out most of these guys here. Then we can just part ways. Took that guy out. There's another guy up there. He got took out. Not by me, though. I took that guy out. Now, I don't see anybody else. Let me go over here. Got. Like a jaguar in the jungle. I just hunted him. And struck. Well, that was kind of corny, but it's all good. It's all good. I'm still here. I'm helping out. Let me go around. Um, Eamon? I don't see nobody yet, but I think I see somebody up here now. I just took him out. I'm still getting shot at. Hold on. Where's this guy at? He's sniping me from, you know what? Hold on. I'm not going to be leaving Bobita. Until, oh damn, I got took out. So I'm back in here now to help out. I need to get the package again. I'm aiming. I'm seeing a package move. That may be my ally. It probably is. So, there seems to be no one else here. I'm just going to be leaving now. I think that's the best thing to do. All right, I'm out. And I'm getting into my vehicle. I have about 10 minutes to get there. Spent a significant amount of time. I think that would be Pepita with the package moving. So, he's out. I've done my part. We went in there. We teamed up. Now, I'm heading towards the drop-off area. 
I'm still getting shot at. I don't know who's shooting at me. But I'm going throughout this freeway and I'm trying to avoid this gunfire. Which seems to be hitting me pretty good. Okay, someone is crashing into me. This may be Pupita messing with me. I'm not too sure yet. But I am going to be cutting over here and then weaving through these cars. See if he could actually keep up. This guy is trying to block my way. He can't stop me. I'm unstoppable. All right, I'm going to keep continuing on this path until I get to the drop-off area. I don't run into any more problems until then. Well, I still don't run into problems now. I'm just saying. I'm getting out of the truck and I'm going to be dropping off this product. I'm out, did my job, and we're supposed to be stealing more product, but I'm not going to be doing that. I'm just going to be driving off, trying to see what else I could do today. And I think, should I go back and get another package? You know what, never mind. I'm going to be sticking to the original plan and just finding something new to do. That's what I'm going to be doing. I uh, see a store. Why not do a little bit of a robbery? Because I need the currency. And as of right now, since I'm just starting online, I really don't have a lot of it. So I've been saving it until I get enough to do whatever I want to do with it. At this point, no, it's you. robbery time. Hold on, please. I'm emptying it. I can't go any faster. The guy is being intimidated. The intimidation bar is rising steadily as I continue to fire at all these products. Just trying to give him an incentive. I really need to get insurance. Now, you might be saying, why am I still aiming at the guy? And I'm just going to be telling you right now, that is probably the best thing to do. Since the last time I tried to pull a robbery, I turned around and the guy started shooting at me. Anyways, I'm being chased right now. I need to get away. Cops came pretty freaking fast. So I'm going back on the map. I'm finding another store. I eventually did get away. And I'm here to make more loot. Because the man needs money. Look at Dub's car. It's all messed up. We can't have that. I'm going inside. Hunt the beast. I'm going to be doing that after I get the money. That's what I came here for. Seems to be the same guy. Is he being intimidated yet? I uh, think so. You should be ashamed of yourself. All right, we got what we came here for. Let's go before he shoots at us. All right, we're out of here. Going to be getting into another chase, and the event is over. That was kind of disappointing at the same time. A little bit later on, I found out that someone put a bounty on my head. I don't know who it is since it's anonymous, but I'm just going to be driving for a little bit. I think someone's going to be coming for my head pretty soon. So I need to prepare for this battle. And that's what I intend on doing just need to find a good area to fight at. at last, I'm not trying to talk you. to you, Yusef. He always calls me talking about some opportunity that I'm unable to take full advantage of. 
Either way, I'm just going to be pulling over here. I think this would be a great place to hide out and actually fight whoever's coming. I'm switching over to the bazooka. There seems to be a business battle going on, but there it is. Someone's coming my way. Why is it aiming at my truck? Okay, I got took out. I should have done better than that, but anyways, I'm over here now, and I just ran into this X. I don't know what's going on, and it seems to be this person right here that seemingly disappeared. What the hell happened here? The man teleported? Did magic happen before my eyes? I don't know, but I started getting chased right after that. And then I found out about this mission, so I'm okay, just going to be taking time it. To execute this day. Buckle up down there because they'll be ready for you at the factory. As usual, deploy any means necessary to secure the cocaine and the cash. All right, why am I getting shot at? I should have been ducking. I got two partners with me this time. I took out another guy and I am not the host we have another player that's doing that I am just a participant and I'm trying to help out the best I can I took out one guy that guy got took out already I'm going over here what am I supposed to be doing destroying it someone destroyed it already and someone just came up from under the door he got took out and I tried to fire I missed that guy another guy's coming up need to take him out got well, that's what's up my partner took him out and I took that guy out I'm taking the lead fire that guy's done. Oh, that guy came up. I'm not sure why I'm running like this. I'm getting shot at continuously. Okay, I took him out. And I shot him in the butt just for that. All right. The other two have taken off. I'm running right behind him. Let's see what's going down here. Okay, I'm just going to hit him. Was way too close. Had no need to shoot him. Not sure if I got him, but that's my partner. Going back over here. Taking this guy out. We're supposed to be going towards the Coke storage area. Well, I took that guy out. little gunfire and men are down another guy got got I think we've cleared the place out I don't know where the other guys went that guy just messed with the computer let me go over here where did the other guy go Maybe I'm supposed to be going towards this area right here, the Coke storage area. This would be it, right? Now, what am I supposed to do here? There's no one coming in this direction. I'm still trying to figure out what to do. Was I supposed to destroy that? I'm not too sure. It's clear this I'm getting shot at. As a chicken factory. Who's in here? Just how bold criminals can be once they have the police in their pocket. It does seem like it. Hold on. Okay, I finally found it. Let me insert the card. 
I was wondering what to do the entire time. Okay, there's another guy in here. I thought I took him out. Well, I think he's finally done. All right, let's get inside. And we're in here now. There seems to be a couple of enemies in here. Just took one guy out. Well, now I took him out. Sometimes these guys need to be shot a few times before they go down. That's what happened here. I'm trying to help search the crates for cocaine, but I don't really know which box I'm supposed to look at. I think there's a green box here I'm climbing over. All right, let's open it. I don't have the required equipment which is why my partner's here, since he does have a crowbar. He came prepared. What happened with me? I don't know. Anyways, I think he opened most of the boxes. I read up on how to use the hacking device so we didn't end up unexpectedly fucked once we made it to this point. All you have to do is find where the signal is the strongest. If the device is showing blue, right direction red you're not once it's caught the connection why am i not the leaving the room okay i'm not supposed to be going that way my partner already disappeared behind the door okay there we go it finally worked i'm outside that room now i'm getting shot at i need to why am i holding that i need an assault weapon Damn, that guy kind of surprised me. Was I supposed to destroy? Okay, never mind. I wasn't supposed to shoot at that. There's someone else here. We have to use the hacking device to find the safe code. Now, where is the hacking device? Do I have it? I think I got it. Okay, I'm just trying to switch to my machine gun. What the hell was that? Now I'm going to this side. And I think this would be the right way. Going into the office. Shoot to office door to find the key to gain access to the office. Which door am I supposed to shoot? I mean, we're already in the office. What are they saying? Okay. I don't know the combination to the lock. I'm trying to see where that is. I don't see it anywhere. It's not on the table, nor the walls. I'm just going to be shooting the door just because? That's what I did. Now, I'm going outside. And I'm going to be shooting this door, trying to see if I could open it. I can't. I don't know why I was trying to get in there in the first place. partner's in here still trying to figure things out he's looking all around too now all three of us are here steal the cash from the safe that's great would this be the code out here maybe I should try these out okay someone's yelling now I have to take this guy out he's still alive he was not anymore I'm still looking at these numbers. Seems like somebody has it. Well, I mean the combination. And another enemy has shown up.
All right, awesome. We just need to go to the car now. A couple of officers have shown up. All right, we're kind of met with some resistance trying to get to this getaway vehicle. We'll take a couple more of these cops out. Once we do that, we can't leave. Helicopter got blew up. You know, I think we're supposed to be headed towards this side. I'm just going to be following my partner. There's a whole bunch of red dots around. Now what's going on here? Okay, see a couple of enemies. I'm gonna take this guy out since he was shooting at my partner and then I took that guy out. Okay, guy got back up. Now he's down. Are we supposed to head inside? I'm going in there. And it's empty. I think my partner already took it. Alright, let's get outside again. Help deliver the loot to Vincent's lockup. Alright, should I get into the vehicle? Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? Where's my partner? Okay, he was inside. Now, hold on. Cops have shown up. Time for me to do my part for the team. Just took those two guys out. This guy came up thinking he was going to be a hero. He got took out. My partner seems to be honking at me. Helicopter is here now. Let me take this guy out. Hold on. Okay, never mind. I'm getting into the truck. It's time to go. He's coming, right? Okay, now. Okay, never mind. I don't know why I got out of the truck, but we're all in the truck now. Finally. After that entire time. All we have to do is just get to this lockup. We have a long ways to go. And we get chased for a while, too. Do stuff like this, where I'm aiming at cars. Well, there's random cars that come at us. You can't tell sometimes in this particular mission. Just got into a little bit of a collision. Now, I'm not going to be showing this entire drive just going to be skipping out of this and after a while we lost the cops you may notice that we're short one team member you know something happened he's in this vehicle now I don't know where he came from how he got this thing but he's just going to be tailing us well kind of tailing us he ran over that woman and crashed into a wall. But we're getting there. That's what we're doing. Taking this left. And he just crashed into another car. Let's go and take this right. This guy's going crazy. And my partner seems to be firing for some odd reason. Okay, we're going, and we have finally reached the lockup. At least for a while. And there it is. The conclusion to the mission. We have passed it and earned a whopping 50,000 bucks. 15 JP, 3,591 RP. There we are.
We're out of here now. And there's my partners right there. Rob Red and Tio Danny. It was good playing with them. Now I'm out of here. We're parting ways. I need to go back onto the map. Found another movie prop. And I'm here to get the goods. So I'm out of the car. Just got out the assault rifle. Getting ready to fire. See the first guy. I took him out immediately. Second guy showed up. Let me take him out. Finally took him out. Now for this guy. All right, all three guys have been taken out. There seems to be a mummy in here. And we're just going to be driving this movie prop to Solomon Richards. Going through the intersection, only have one star. So it's not really too bad. Let me take a right here. I uh, see a purple bubble on the map. I'm still getting chased by the cops, but I'm going to be checking this out because one, I remember a trick that my partner used where we just parked in a parking lot and the whole cop chase basically ended in a couple of seconds. So I'm going to be doing that here. Let me put away my gun and then talk to this guy, see what this is about. It's a street dealer and he sells drugs. Didn't know that was in the game. All right, I am going to be getting into the van. And just like that, the cop chase has ended. So all I need to do now is deliver this to Solomon's office. Obviously, you're not going to be seeing the entire drive. Here I am. Breaking through the arm. And we're here. And we have found two out of 10 movie props that we've returned. I'm going to try to return eight more of them in the upcoming episodes. Speaking about that, I'm going to be ending this episode and releasing episode number seven pretty soon. If you haven't done it yet, then I would appreciate that like, subscribe, and even slapping that notification bell. I want to thank you and everyone that has subscribed to the channel. Y'all are awesome. Until the next time, I hope you have a good one. Peace out.